Secretary, will you resign over Windrush? Who knew and when? The Home Secretary, number 10. Everyone round here says they're sorry now. Foreign Secretary, is the Cabinet united on immigration? But how did the Windrush scandal slip the government's notice? Her department is taking most of the strain. I bitterly, deeply regret that I didn't see it as more than individual cases that had gone wrong that needed addressing. I didn't see it as a systemic issue until very recently. But does she think, as many in Westminster do, that the problems are a byproduct of the government's overall approach? Oh, Secretary, do you agree that the net migration target has distorted the decision making and led us to a lot of these problems? No, I don't. I don't think that's got anything to do with it. Have you asked the Prime Minister to get rid of the net migration target? I have not discussed that with the Prime Minister. You've not discussed the, discussed the net migration target? I think, with I think her I'm not all. going to be drawn any further than private conversations I might have with the Prime Minister. You said when you were initially asked by the, the Chair um, that you had not discussed the net migration target with the Prime Minister, and then you said you're not going to be drawn on private conversations. In Which answer? In the, in the context of what we're here to discuss, which is the whole Windrush saga, the whole Windrush um, sadness, really. I have not discussed the net migration target with the Prime Minister, what the chair was asking me about. The Empire Windrush brings to Britain 500 Jamaicans. Those who made Britain their home were failed by the government. The government itself has admitted, treated as if they'd had no right to live here because they didn't always have the paperwork to prove it. Ministers are trying to make amends now, but there's no escaping from the mess round here. The Windrush generation are not illegal. They are not illegal. They are here legally. That is, that is why, that is why we are providing the support to enable them to get the documents for their, uh, for their status. Jeremy Corbyn. The current Home Secretary inherited a failing policy and made it worse. Isn't it time she took responsibility and resigned? And just as Commonwealth tradition was celebrated on Whitehall today, some of the government's top brass are arguing for bigger changes to the British welcome for people from other countries. The Foreign Secretary suggesting in Cabinet yesterday there should be an amnesty for those who have come here illegally but have lived in Britain for more than 10 years. Are you at odds with the Prime Minister on immigration? How are you? How are you? That idea was about as welcome in number 10 as the hailstorm later. But the Windrush scandal has not just embarrassed the government but has underscored the differences within.